Ryan St. Anne Gewellinger, aka Ryan Gewellinger Scott, aka Ryan St. Anne Scott, aka Ryan Patrick Scott, Damien St. Anne, Randall Dean Stocks, Randall Dean Stocks, aka Father Ryan Scott. Who is this man? A quick Google search shows that Father Ryan Scott, or whatever you choose to call him, is a self proclaimed American traditionalist priest that has never been ordained. Take a listen to this. I've never been conned like that in my life. With as many investigations that we've done, this guy topped it all. Lawsuits, missing money, unaccounted for funds, angry, angry people, every entity that he touched. I love my Catholic brothers and sisters, but our levels of naivety and gullibility honestly have me pulling my hair out. There is no reason to be angry when we are daily allowing ourselves to be so easily bamboozled by every Tom, Dick and Harry that comes in the name of Christ. Discernment is a gift, people. Do we not pray for this daily? Are you rolling now? The self-proclaimed monk who's been in and out of jail is now suing the sheriff's department. They are the fakes. They were having sex on this bench. Ryan Scott has been accused of swindling millions from people and even went as far as offering his services as a fake priest to baptisms, weddings and confessions. It took many, many years for members of his churches, yes, churches, to open their eyes and see him for what he truly is. But the sad reality is that people like Ryan Scott come at a dime a dozen. Come on, John, that can't be true. There's the stains. You have the audacity to call me the commerce. All this stuff is listed on a police report. I've never been conned like that in my life. With as many investigations that we've done, this guy topped it all. Lawsuits, missing money, unaccounted for funds, angry, angry. You have the audacity to call me the commerce. All this stuff. There are wolves in sheep's clothing lurking everywhere. But what's even worse is the sheep that we have become. Matthew 24 verse 14 tells us that false prophets will appear and perform great signs and wonders to deceive even the elect. And here's a man not even performing any great or miraculous deeds that has the ability of causing people to swoon and just hand over their possessions in a heartbeat. Wake up, people. Stop falling for this rubbish. Your Savior is Jesus Christ. There is no man coming to save you except Him.